Hey everyone, I'm T and Eagle. Welcome back. This is episode 8 of our FIFA 15 My Player Career. And right now in this video, we are going to have three games to get through. And if you remember in the last video, uh, we did indeed receive a red card. So we got a uh, we got a game off to, to relax and uh, think about our actions. Uh, if you're enjoying this series, guys, please make sure you drop a like. Please comment. Please subscribe. I do enjoy to see those thumbs up, and it does indeed help my channel grow. And also, if you haven't yet, please follow me on Twitter at b 12 tn Eagle. Kind of stay up to date with everything that's going on in the channel, as well as anything from around the sports world. And we will now get into our first match, and this one will be against FC Dallas. And quite honestly, I mean, it seems like, and I hope I'm wrong, but I would hope that as we improve as a player that our teammates also improve because that would be awesome because they're not very good right now. Um, <laughs> I would say like overall, like my, my teammates are just, uh, I don't know. They're, they're just kind of everywhere. So to speak, like they don't, they don't do the things they're supposed to do, uh, you know, on the pitch and it's, it, you know, they'll run the wrong way on defense and, it's frustrating at times. It's really frustrating, but uh, we're still, you know, trying to do our best to get things going individually, and, and we obviously have some work to do as well. But you can see here, uh, we will pick up another uh, plus one to our aggression, and we will also get some new celebrations for that for drawing 15 fouls, and uh, and that's pretty good. I mean, we haven't played a ton of games, so we're drawing a, a good bit of fouls and, and trying to beat some people off the dribble and stuff, which a lot of times can lead to fouls. Uh, in this game mode, but um, we'll move forward here, and we're going to get a decent attempt here, and I probably should have tried to cut inside, but uh, right now, uh, I believe I'm still in the, the three-star skills, so my skill moves are a little bit limited, uh, but probably still should have done something a little bit better there, but here, uh, we'll get another uh, plus one to aggression for a nice seal out there, and then uh, we'll also get a plus one to our attack position, and uh, there was something in there about the medium hair length style. So uh, we're moving on. I mean, our guy is really going to start uh, improving pretty rapidly here in these next few games, I think. But here we get a decent opportunity, and I, I went up to try to head it in. And it was just able, unable to get anything going there. And then we'll see all the way in the 83rd minute, uh, FC Dallas. And that was really, I mean, it was frustrating, but that was a pretty nice little touch pass right there uh, by FC Dallas to get that shot in on goal and that is how that game would end unfortunately so uh, we did go down one nil and our rating was not very good you see we did have one shot on target one shot off target but an overall rating of 5.8 is not going to get it done but i uh, wanted to go in and check after that game just because i've been uh, you know unlocking a lot of things or i guess i don't know getting like the plus one and stuff so i wanted to check in and i hadn't checked in a couple games as far as what traits that i had available and I was uh, pleasantly surprised that I had quite a few because I had the skill dribbling. But then I went in and put the swerve pass on. I got the fancy passes, fancy flicks, bicycle kicks. I'm like, wow, this is this is awesome. It's like Christmas. So, uh, you know, getting all these on here and your guy uh, miraculously jumps pretty good there. And, and I guess it makes sense because uh, I had also gone up to a four star skiller. So you're going to improve in a lot of areas uh, when you do that. So uh, that was pretty good to see. But. We'll get into the second game, and this one is against the Colorado Rapids. And uh, you can see here right off the bat, and, or not really right off the bat, but 19th minute, um, we get taken down pretty early in that one. So Colorado will pick up a yellow there. And then here in the 36th minute, I get a decent chance. And, uh, you know, I mean, just I went two bars there on the power, which was not nearly enough uh, to get that one in. And then Colorado had hit us. Want a nice little uh, build up there in the 45th minute. So right before halftime, they're able to get in and uh, and score a pretty nice goal uh, to put us down one nil. So not a lot we can do, but uh, you know we're thinking, okay, we're going into halftime, and but they almost had time uh, to to get all the way down the pitch and score. But instead, you know, we're gonna cut them off and we're just gonna we're gonna commit a penalty in the box. So <laughs> we uh, we didn't do very well there, but. They then hit the post on the PK, so we really got lucky there as far as being able to uh, to just keep it a one-goal deficit. And here, I don't know, it didn't seem like a long shot, but we get a plus one to our long shots. Also a plus one to our shot power, 
Um, so you can see a lot of these things that, that kind of work their way up. As, uh, you know, some of it is more as far as how many games you play, but also like how many shots you get and on target and so forth. So, uh, again, we're really starting to build up our guy now, and I think this is where we're going to start really making a difference as far as what we're doing. And here, I mean, he went to go shoot, and it just seemed like it took forever to shoot and uh, couldn't get a shot off. So we would actually lose that game 1-0. So there's two games and two games lost, one nil, and then kind of same thing. Uh, one shot on target, one shot off target, about the same rating. That one was a 5.9. Uh, but you can see it just uh, we're not doing well offensively uh, right now. But we need to pick that up because obviously our average rating is below target. Our goals are below target. Our CISPA are below target. So this game, we're going to go against our rivals, the uh, New York Red Bulls. We'll get things going in the 14th minute, and I almost was able to get that pass out. And then I don't know if the computer was passing that or if that was a shot. It's really difficult to tell, but uh, we'll move into the 38th minute. And I was actually able to get a, a ball ahead to my teammate, but you can see I picked up a couple more things there, one of them being dribbling, uh, which I think is going to be important as well. So uh, we'll continue on with that. But here, and there is a little bit of a nice dribbling, kind of getting around the defender, but then I ran into kind of one too many, so we couldn't do much there. But look at S pass, but more importantly, look at the volley from my teammate. You know I'm saying in the beginning, how they're not doing as much and they're not very good, but uh, this was a pretty awesome to see. Look at this, boop, just a one time volley uh, with the left foot cross goal. I mean, that was just a beautiful, beautiful goal right there. So uh, we will take that one, that will put us up 1 0, and we'll take the assist. And then, uh, you know, right after halftime, I went for a, kind of a long shot. I was trying to trying to get one in there. I was unable to do so, uh, but you know it's at least good to get a shot in. But then we'll actually get the ball back uh, on defense. I'll do a nice little skill move there, get around the defender and send it in with the shot, and that will put us up two nil. We'll also get plus one to our ball control, plus one to our finishing, and we'll see on the replay that little move right there at the end really uh, enabled us to get get the space we needed to get it around the keeper. And we will certainly take that any day of the week. And uh, that is our seventh goal uh, in M MLS right now. So that was pretty good. And then here in the 53rd minute, just a little bit of dribbling. And then check this shot out. A nice finesse shot. We'll get plus one to our curve for that for five out of five goals. And then also we'll pick up the outside foot trait, which I'm pretty excited about. I'll probably drop the, I guess, the bicycle kicks uh, for the outside foot trait. But uh, what a great shot right here. And I don't, I'm not really sure if I could have made that. Uh, you know, an episode or two ago uh, based upon what our rating was. But, uh, you know, just the getting everything built up here lately has certainly helped us. So uh, that will put us up 3-0. And then here in the 66th minute, I'm going to break through again, and I will score that one. So that puts us up 4-0. That is our first career hat trick. We also have the assist in this game. So we uh, account for all four goals or have a piece of all four goals. And that is pretty exciting for our first career hat trick. Uh, against the rival Red Bulls, and a beautiful shot there, cross goal. The keeper really had no chance uh, from that distance, and we were able to bang that one in. And it gives us nine goals, so it was uh, pretty good to see right there. And then here in the 76th minute, I'll get a plus one to the agility for beating a player off the dribble, uh, and also would give me a plus one to dribbling, and then also a plus one to our uh, skill move. So. Now we can start to do a few more of the skill moves that uh, will enable us to get some space. And I certainly wouldn't call myself a skiller, but I can uh, use this, the effective skill moves that will give your guy uh, extra space that sometimes you would need to either get a pass off or get a shot off, whatever the case may be. So I look forward to using some of those, which will only help us uh, individually. So and uh, that being said, will help us as a team. So uh, pretty excited about some of the the added, added uh, attributes that we'll have from this uh, episode and from this game. And they will certainly help make us better. But we're certainly climbing in the right direction. And we are simmed out uh, or subbed out. And so we will sim out the rest of that match. And you can see we continue to get the plus ones, ball control, penalties, uh, attacking position. So uh, as we picked up the man of the match, obviously, in that match. And uh, now that changes our rating and our, our objectives a little bit. And we're now a little bit more on target of where we'd like to be. Uh, but that will wrap it up for this episode, guys. As I'll kind of leave you uh, with the league objectives and uh, the primary and secondary objectives. You see we're still below target. I think now we have the, the assault and munition to move forward. Thanks, guys. Have a good one.